Good morning, guys. Uh, today, when you click on your assignment, the link I had there takes you to this music. Now, you it's set up to where it shows all of the parts. You have violin part, viola part, cello part, bass part. Okay, these are all the notes on the D string. This is D. This is E1. This is F sharp. Two fingers for violins and violas, three fingers for cellos, four fingers for bass. This is G, three fingers for violin and viola, four for cello, and zero on the skinny string, G string, for bass. Okay, once you get to here, to just have your part, let's say you're a viola player, you're going to go up here, you're going to click parts. And you're going to find this part where it says show and just click the circle for your instrument. I'm going to pretend I'm a viola player, so I'm going to click that. And now there it is. And then you can push play. It will tell you how it sounds. Rest, 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 rest. This means repeat. D, D, rest, rest, E. E, rest, rest, F sharp, F sharp, rest, rest, G, G, rest, rest. And that's all you have today to practice. If you're not sure how to do these fingers, go and look at Mr.'s diagrams. Here's where I show you what all the notes look like. Some things to remember. Whoa. Go back to some things to remember. This is important stuff. We're playing in guitar position, violins and violas, but your wrist should always be straight. Fingers should be curved. Fingers should point down to the fingerboard. Shing fingers should not be curved. Sorry, fingers should be curved and on the tips, not flat. Your hand should be relaxed. Try not to get tense. And your thumb goes across from your first and second finger. Here's what first finger looks like for violin. That's sorry, that's for viola. That's one finger, E. Two fingers, F sharp. Three fingers for G. And four fingers for A on the D. Okay, you, if you're not a viola player, obviously you're going to go to your instrument to look at those. All right, email me if you have any questions. Talk to you later.